Diamonds are forever. Diamonds are forever, forever. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're already a subscriber, welcome. Hey guys, so we're going to get right into the video. So the first thing you're going to need is something to mix the mash together. You want to use something that is plastic and I got this from Amazon for a really great price. So of course you're going to need your clay. You're going to add two scoops. I use the second size and you're going to also need either apple cider vinegar or water. I prefer to use apple cider vinegar because it is stronger. And you want to put one more spoon of the apple cider vinegar than the clay. So if you do two scoops of the clay, you're going to put three of the apple cider vinegar. And two scoops is enough for one person. So if it's just you, you want to use one scoop of the clay, which is the second size, which I believe has number five on it. And then you want to use two of the apple cider vinegar. And if it gets too watery for you, you can still add more clay, or if it's still too thick, you can add more apple cider vinegar. The consistency I like to get is like a thick pancake consistency and you want to make sure that it is very smooth. So you're going to keep stirring until you have no lumps in your mask because you do not want lumps because that is just clumps of clay. Once your clay is done, it should look like this. And again, if you want it thicker, you make it thicker. So here is my motto. This is Jordan. And today I'm going to be using a brush that came with the set. Again, I will link the set down below. I got it from Amazon and it got to me pretty fast. When applying the mask, it is going to come on really cold. No matter if the apple cider vinegar is room temperature or not, it's still going to be pretty cold once you get that first hit onto your skin. You want to put it on trying to avoid any facial hair, such as mustache, beard, and eyebrows. If it gets into your hair, like your hairline or anything, or any of your facial hair, it is completely fine. You'll be okay. You can also use this for a deep conditioner for your hair. And if you like a video on that, comment down below and I'll get that video out for you guys. And again, you want to make sure that you apply this evenly on the skin so that it all dries at the same pace. You want to leave it on for about 20 to 30 minutes. You're going to feel a burning sensation, tingling sensation. And your face is also going to appear very stiff. You're not going to be able to laugh. You're not going to be able to talk. But that is completely fine. Do not be afraid. And again, I said this mask is good for two people. 
so you're gonna still gonna have some left. A few moments later. So he's had the mask on for about 30 minutes. So now we're gonna wash it off using warm to cool water and we're gonna show you the end results. Two thousand years later. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if it was helpful, comment down below. Make sure that you subscribe and give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you in my next video. Oh, <laughs>